It's time for The Breakaway, presented by Frontier Communications. Well, Jake, one thing we do know about him is he is hands down the best dressed <laughs> on the Portland Timbers. I mean, this outfit, Lars, what inspired it this morning? I don't know. When you, they contacted me and told me I had to come <laughs> here, I told myself, OK, I have to dress well because uh, I need to represent a little bit. <laughs> and you also told me if your mom saw this, she would be disappointed if you weren't yeah, looking your best. She would, to she would tell me that I didn't make you grow up this way, <laughs> so you have to be a little bit more attentive. <laughs> so you're very close with your family, and you have a daughter a young little baby son and yeah. a wife that are coming over to Portland in a couple of weeks, right? Yeah, no, a couple of days now. Wow. Yeah. Are you excited? Very excited because I'm here alone trying to discover the city all by myself and uh, I miss them. And your wife, your teenage sweetheart, when did you meet? I met her uh, in 2000 and I don't remember she would kill She'll me. be mad at you, but that's <laughs> no, all right, 2000, okay. 2004, uh, sorry, 2004. So uh, it's been like almost 13 years we together. Wow. Yeah. Were you guys in high school or where was it just where you grew I was, up? I was in the, no, we were from the same neighborhood. Uh, I was at the academy. She was going uh, out uh, of the city to go and study. Uh, when we went back to our city, Every Friday, I used to meet her in the, in the train. I never booked my ticket, oh. so I had to run away uh, the, the controllers. <laughs> and Were you I, doing that just to find her? Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> sometimes, I think more so. No. So wait, so you would run away because you didn't buy a ticket? I didn't buy a ticket, yeah. I, I, I never used to buy. My mother used to give me this money to, to buy the ticket, but I just keep it for myself to buy <laughs> some other stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. So uh, when we spoke uh, at the training facility a couple weeks ago, you told me that one thing you love about the U.S. is the NBA, basketball. Yeah. When did you start watching? I started watching, like, first of all, because my cousin was a professional basketball player. And uh, I started to be very interesting in basketball uh, back in 96. So I was a Jordan fan. Michael Jordan and the yeah. Bulls. Yeah, of course. Yeah, they used to be great. Where did your cousin play? He played in uh, Paris. Huh. Yeah. So you come from an athletic family. Yeah, he was very tall. I was impressed by the way he was eating because he could <laughs> eat like big plates of pastas, and uh, I was like, it's not possible to eat. That. <laughs> now I'm the same. So <laughs> now you can eat as much yeah. as you want. What's your favorite food? Um, uh, this rice from, mom, uh, from my mama and uh, the special sauce with the chicken. I can eat chicken like every day. What's the special sauce? What's in it? Do we know? Uh, you know, we call this uh, saka saka. Saka saka? Yeah, What's you have in it? like veggies, you have a lot of things. I, I don't even know how to, <laughs> to make this, so it's just the speciality of the country. So. You're here in the U.S. now playing in Major League Soccer, which means you're going to get to see a lot of this country. But I know there's one city that you're very excited to visit. New York. New York, New York, where yeah. I am from. I'm a big fan of that as well. What do you like about New York? You know, New York is like the, the big city, big lights. Uh, everything is great. I like this city. I've been there once, uh, and I really loved it. So, but uh, I, I want to go back again. What are some things you want to do? In, in New York? <laughs> there are crazy things to do there. Uh, Lots to do. Yeah, yeah. Pizza, bagels, best food ever. Ever. <laughs> ever. <laughs> so we'll, we'll be there later this season, which will be fun. You'll get to play at Yankee Stadium, Yeah. which will be awesome. So uh, what are some other interests you have away from the field? What do you like to do when you're not training, not at a game, and right now not with family? So what do you, what do, you do to entertain yourself? I am very lazy, <laughs> you know, when the training is over, I just stay at home, um, naps or watching movies. Um, you know, when I have to go out, it's just because my wife tell me, okay, we have to go there, we have to do this and do that. But <laughs> if it was from me, we would stay <laughs> home every day. <laughs> I like, I can't wait to meet your wife. She sounds awesome. Yeah. Laying down the law for Laris. I like it. Well, thank you so much for coming on Timbers in 30 thank this you. week. Really thank great you. to get to know more about you.